Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I am Sabrina and today we are going to be doing a, another haul video. Recently I have been testing brands in a different way in some of my videos. So instead of just doing like a typical haul from a website, I've been trying to test them out for something specific. So for example, test some of their homeware stuff, testing out like a gym wear range, testing out like festival clothing. And I am a massive fan of ASOS. ASOS is probably one of my favorite sites of all time. I look on the website like pretty much every day just to see what the new in stuff is. And I haven't done a haul from ASOS in the longest time. I order bits and pieces from there, but I don't feel like I've done a haul since I actually tested my festival clothing from ASOS. So today we are going to be testing ASOS cords. Now, not everything is ASOS branded, but everything is obviously from ASOS. And one of the reasons why I'm so excited about this video is that recently I've had really bad self-control with opening packages before the video but it's so much more exciting if we open it together so I haven't actually seen anything inside there I think I have like six cohorts we do have a little visitor behind me she's just cruising there she's the funniest little thing like as soon as I make the bed or if like it looks quite fresh she instantly like would like jump onto it and like it's nice and poofy and she just likes to pretty much sleep all the time Let's get in here. I'm actually quite hot, like it's such a good day. I was thinking I need to open the window, but then it gets quite loud. And you know, the outfit, the outfit. Let me pull up my order so that I can see the prices and everything. And that I know what size I ordered stuff in, etc. Come on in, come on in, sign in, bro. No, I don't have it. Sorry, I just want to see my order. Thank you. Oh, I see something that I like so much. Hopefully we don't like everything because that'll be a pretty expensive uh, to keep. Let me see. Okay, so the order total was 246 pounds and I got one, two, three, four, five, six cords, like I thought. So let's start with, ooh, this one. So this is ASOS branded. Oh no, wait, what? Guys, what a weird start. I ordered something that I don't think is actually a set. What the hell? I've ordered three parts of a set. Have I actually done that? Okay, so I think I really have done that. So basically, I've ordered a crop top and like cycling shorts which I thought that this was a top four, but when I ordered this, it actually ordered the whole cord. So I guess this is like a three-way cord right now. Let's see. This is a different material to what I'd anticipated. So it's called a crinkle material, and these are cycling shorts in a size eight. I'm not gonna lie, these look a little bit weird to me. Uh, I don't necessarily feel like this is something I would have purchased if I'd just seen it chilling like in a store. Um, I don't know how flattering it's going to be on me. So these were 12 legging shorts in jersey crinkle cord. Yeah, these were 12 pounds. And then, what? Did I? Oh my gosh, this is what I've done, guys. I ordered two pairs of the exact same thing. And then I ordered the wrong cord top. Is this the same size? I ordered two you get eight of these oh my gosh that's hilarious so one of these is definitely going to be going back so this was the matching like boxy crew neck thing that I ordered to go with it that I thought was the match and I thought they were both going to be like more of this material if I'm honest they're not even the same color fuck my life this is like a mocker shade um I do really like this so it's like a really oversized boxy sweater top i think i got a 10 for this yeah i got a uk 10 because i wanted it to be nice and oversized i like the raw hem and i don't have anything in this color right now and i think this would be super cute i will try them on together but how they look together mm, we don't really know about that and this one cost why have you exited me mate this one was 60, 16, not 60, 16 pounds. 
and it's also from the ASOS brand. I was expecting a little more Kylie Jenner than what we're actually dealing with. So even though these aren't actually like a set, or maybe they are, but they are slightly different like color and texture to each other. Um, my legs look like sausage casings. Like it fits fine, whoopsie, fits fine around the top here, like this is chilled, woohoo. Um, but as soon as it gets down to my thighs, which are thick, thicker, um, yeah. It gets a little bit tight to say the least. Like honestly, my legs are going in and out again because it's so tight over here. So definitely hating these. Um, really liking this color though. Can't say I own a lot of like mocha clothing. Um, the jumper is really oversized. Like I guess you would expect that because this is a size 10 and it was kind of oversized anyway. But I'm kind of living for this. I feel like. It would make a really cute little like airport jumper and if I was more like bougie I think I could pull off a two piece like this also if they fitted me um, but I just don't really know if I am potentially you could wear like black or like cream little legs um, and trainers and make an outfit but right now my legs are suffocating so I'm going to be taking this off but I definitely feeling like this jumper is quite bougie it's pretty like Massive so I don't know if I would have been better off with an 8 over a 10 I can just roll the sleeves up if I want to but I quite like that. It's oversized like this Like I think it makes it feel that little bit more comfortable like extra comfy Holla 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 uh, uh. Okay next up Let's go for something that actually is a set and I'm really excited about this one because it's a brand that I have never ordered from on the ASOS site before and it's called Unique 21 and I've seen quite a lot of cute things um, from there and this is just a shorts and blazer set which when I saw it I was instantly in love with it like before I even decided I was going to film this video I actually saw this set and wanted to get it because I just thought it was so cute for like autumn and spring so this set was Twin, it's this okay. This is like the most expensive. Is it the most expensive? I think it's the most expensive thing that I ordered. It was 30 pounds for the trousers and 28 pounds for the top. So, all in all, pretty much 60 quid for this set. Let's say it looks like it's in a slightly different material to what I had imagined. Mike is whistling in the kitchen because he gets really happy when he makes his lunch. I think he's making like chicken wraps or something, which probably got him really in a good mood because that's not really a vibe I can see a small mark on this I will show you it's very small um, but yeah it's definitely there I thought it was a hair at first but it ain't it feels like nice quality it's so cute so this is the top it is like a peplum style like vest thing I don't even know how to explain it because it's not like anything that I own. I don't know if I like that small necessarily. <laughs> it's so cute though. Like, oh my gosh, I'm really excited to try this on. So this is in a size eight. And then the trousers, I think I got it in a 10. Oh, I also got an eight for this. I use the like ASOS size guide checker um, when I am like buying something. So it'll give you like your suggested size and then you can also refine it down more by answering like some questions about past purchases etc um so it recommended eight for me important please read before moving this label oh right okay oh, i'm glad i got an eight because these look quite big um i would like to wear them like high-waisted style um so this is how they are they're freaking cute like they're really cute they've got stripes down the front and then stripes on the side panel that go in the opposite direction this is just not like anything that I own at all. It's very business chic. I think it's quite like a mature outfit, which I definitely need more of. I realized recently that I have a lot of clothes that are cute, but not work appropriate and are like good for going to festivals and like clubbing and stuff, which let's face it, I don't really do that much. So I need to switch it up. Also, side note that I think that the trousers could be slightly see-through. 
but we'll know when I actually try it on. So this little set is quite nice. Um, I do like it. I definitely way prefer the top to the bottoms. I think the top is really cute. It's like business cool. Um, I like its vibe. Um, I like that it's like a little bit lower down here. It's a little bit risque because it's only just joined at that little button and then the rest of you is just out free. Uh, but I do really like this. I feel like together it's very like um, blogger-esque, let me call it that. Like it's very good for photos and um, it could be like the type of thing you wear with like outrageous boots or something to like fashion week or like a really bright bag. Um, maybe I'm wrong. Um, I'm no fashion guru. Um, it feels that way. So the only problem that I have is... And I get this problem so much. And if any of you guys out there have like a smaller waist and bigger calves, which sounds like not a real struggle, but those two things combined means that trousers don't fit you right. So basically at the top here, like it's kind of fine. Um, it could be a little bit more like tighter in like the way that it fits, but I can live with this because it's covered. Um, but basically at the bottom, it's definitely tighter around my calves. Um, it's noticeably tighter around them. And it's like looser, like not loose fitted, but looser fitted. And then when it gets to the bottom, it's suddenly like fitted AF, like a pair of jeans. Um, yes, that is my calf life and what I deal with. But I do really like this top. I might consider keeping the top and I can just wear it with some of my own trousers. But it's really cute. Um, I definitely think I'm going to try and get like more tops in the style going forward because... I do really enjoy that. I think it's very, very pretty. And this feels very slinky on, like it's a socky outfit. I'm not even lying, guys. I think I've ordered half of a cord again. I think instead of ordering the other piece of this, I ordered two of those pieces of shorts by mistake. So I got a Vespa square neck crop top. It says cord in red, but I can definitely only see the top. So that is how it looks there. Um, I can only see the top of that and not the trousers, so that's a bit confusing. That means it was 25 just for the top, so you would expect really nice quality. What? Oh, these are the arms. Oh, it does feel like amazing quality, not gonna lie. It's not a brand that I've ever heard of before. That's what I love about ASOS. This is how it looks. It's very, like, solid and rigid, almost like a denim. Like, the material definitely feels good quality. It looks quite big. What size did I get? I got it in a 10. Why did I do that? Yeah, I ordered it in a 10. You know what, I probably thought I was ordering the trousers and then got them in a 10, but I got the top in a 10. So this is gonna be too big, but definitely nice quality. I would, I'm gonna go and check this brand out and see what else they do. This is like how the little logo looks. This is really cute, but I'm really sad about this. How cute would have a cord been in this? with this top and like matching structured like tailored trousers oh. as we thought the crop top is definitely too big so i have no idea why i ordered this in a 10 i think i was ordering the trial i think i thought that i was ordering the trousers but i certainly was not and it's too big for me i'm really disappointed though because actually it's such a nice color the material is like a little bit stretchy even though it's rigid and like whoa, whoa and it's literally so nice like you do expect it to be good quality i think for 25 pounds just for the top um but it's definitely one of those pieces where it would last you really long and it would be like a staple like a classic it would just always look good um so i think i would have needed at least an eight in this um to make it the right size uh, but i do really like it and i'm going to check this brand out Samoa. Um, unfortunately, I don't have the trousers to show you guys because I didn't order them because I'm foolish. So, yeah, this is this. Okay, this is definitely a cold <laughs> and it's from Pretty Little Thing. I'm excited about this one because I think that it's one that I would want to wear in on my holiday back to South Africa in like two weeks time. So um, the top was 20, no, the, the trousers were 25 pounds. The top was 12 pounds and I got them both in a size eight. So the top is like a halter neck style. I feel like it's gonna be soft. It's like a crinkle, like a crinkly material again. Okay, 
So this is how it is like it goes around. <laughs> Look at me. <gasps> what the fuck? Yes, <laughs> I think it goes like around your neck and then you tie the um, like boobs in the front like so it's a bit hard to show you guys like this but obviously i'll be trying everything on i just thought this was like quite a fun pattern it's navy and red flowers i love a good floral print i'm like the floral queen i got this in a size eight it seems quite big but that's probably because it's not tied up um, but i really like the look of this and then um, the bottoms the bottoms are so cute they're like these flared leg trouser bottoms and they should sit like quite high up yeah it looks like it'll be the right size to do that so they'll sit high rise and then flow all the way down i'm in love with these i can just tell you guys now that i would get so much wear out of them because you don't have to wear it as a cord such a fun and like easy like breezy easy breezy trouser for if you're like going to like the beach or if you're going to like for like beach drinks and let's just say you were wearing your bikini and then you have these trousers on at the bottom and like a little white crochet crop top or something that is very cute i really really like the look of these pretty little thing delivering the goods so this was definitely <clears throat> what the hell where is my voice this is definitely my favorite one that i've tried on so far it's definitely more of my style and i'm obsessed with this like bohemian print i think that it's so so cute i really like the way that it fits it was so hard to work out how to put the top on i was just not being very sensible about it and i kept on putting it on the wrong way around i even asked mike to help me and we couldn't do it for like five minutes but eventually i got it on i really like the way that it fits um i do think with the bottoms like i potentially could have gotten one size smaller um, and it would have fit more tightly, but I don't really mind how it's fitting right now I will just show you guys the bottom so that you can see How like the flared legs look so they are quite long for me Even if I wore high shoes, they would be touching the ground So you would just have to get over that or you would need to hem them up if you were a little shouty like me um, I really really like this though. It's super cute. I think I'm gonna keep this one. It's very like really nice for like an evening out um i can imagine myself like going for not like clubs night out but like beach style cafe out for dinner and cocktails i like it i know pretty little thing wouldn't disappoint me i haven't actually done a pretty little thing order in a hot minute um but yeah i'm obsessed with this it's definitely my favorite piece so far i don't know why but for some reason like I feel like I'm looking so much more pale on camera than I look in real life. Um, maybe it's because I've gone for like a slider cut fur. Maybe it's because I've gone for like a darker eyeshadow underneath the eye. Like I've gone a little bit further down than I usually would. I was trying to be extra. Don't know if I'm feeling it though. Next. So this has come in like a cord bag. I think it's come like with everything in one. Yes. Oh, I'm so excited for this. So... This is £45 for the set, and it's a beach cord. How do I get into you? Hello? Hello? So happy it's like cooled down a bit. Oh, she's just so preciously cute. She doesn't even stirred, which is quite unusual for her. This is honestly such a cute set. I'm really happy with this order because I've ordered from a lot of brands that I have never tried before. And so, yeah, this is glamorous. Um, this is their little website over here this is the top wow it is like a really cute bandeau style little ruched crop top love this color so cute like it's like a linen-y kind of feeling and i think it would be really nice and cool in the summer and then it just comes with this little skirt now this is not a style of skirt that i've worn a lot and it doesn't always work on me because i am five foot three so i'm quite short and sometimes they sit quite awkwardly on me where it looks like i don't know like a bad school skirt um but i'm hoping that this fits nicely um it's just really cute and i feel like it's the type of thing that you put on and you're like outfit did summer did like i like something where it just looks like you put a lot more thought into it than you actually did and it feels really nice so i'm excited to try that the only thing that i'm seeing right now that's bothering me was this but i'm assuming actually that it's supposed to go up because at first i was like why doesn't go down but i think this is how 
it is made to go off like that. I'm very confused about this cord because I like it, but they're just little things that are putting me off. I'm sorry, yes, I know I'm very um, pale for today's video. I recently bought a similar style of dress to this um, in the sense that the bottom of the dress was like also poofed out. I just find often that there's too much material. Um, I would like it so much more if there was like that much. I just don't necessarily find it that flattering when it goes like all the way out. So if it was like this, I would like this like a lot more. Um, so this part I don't really like. I like the way that it sits here. It's very comfortable. Um, I probably could have had a size smaller in the bottom half of this. Um, it is cute though. Like I think it looks cute, but I just don't think I would wear it. And then this is like my main problem with this is... The way that the top looks is very cute, but when you go like, look at it close up, I really am pained by the way that these are meeting up. So when you pull it out, these are like a match, but when it ruches in, it looks like it goes straight kind of, and then goes off center. And I just don't really like it that much. Also, this is annoying me. That's probably just because it's been in the package, but something is happening where it's like not straight and it's bothering me a little bit but i do really like this top little frill detail and i do think this would be a cute like little outfit for some people for me i think it might be too like i don't know like a little girly and frilly um i think i'm a little bit more i just wear a lot of black basically and i'm a tend to be a little bit more like grungy in my style i just wanted to like try out what they had um but i just don't think that i would wear this i feel like i'm about eight years old um but this could be cute on some people it's definitely comfortable but i don't think it is worth 45 pounds which i think is what the price was whoa not staying stable yeah i don't really think it was worth 45 pounds unfortunately so i am going to be returning this one so this is the last cord and it is the one that i think i'm the most excited about it is an asos branded cord and it is a woven stripe bandeau frill beach cord top and the trousers are um, woven stripe for beach sarong cold skirt. Oh, it's a skirt, not trousers. Oh, yes. Um, so I got the skirt in a UK 6 and the top in an 8. I didn't want the top to be too, like, tight around this part of the arm. So that's why I upsized in those. And then for the skirt, I thought because you tie it yourself, like it's a wrap tie vibe, I would rather size down and I can always tighten it rather than getting one where at the tightest it's too big. If you know what I'm saying. Okay, well this feels nice. This linen-y texture is very nice. So cute. This is the top. Oh my god, guys. I'm obsessed with this. I think this is my favorite thing that I've seen so far. So this is the top of it. It's just like a complete like frill vibe. And what I love is that this very front panel is double layered. So it is not see-through. And then it's basically got this tie around detail. So this will tie behind your back. Um, honestly, this is such a cute outfit. I can see myself going out for like a nice lunch with the girls, like at a wine farm. That's the kind of vibe that this is giving me. And it's really soft. Like it's softer than the other linen one. Go on ASOS. Killing it. Skirt. Skirt. Oh, here we go. Skirt, skirt. Skirt, skirt. Ooh. <laughs> I just feel like this would be the most flowy, comfortable thing. Like you could go and eat like a big lunch and just be super chilled. Okay, so it does have a button, but I'm actually really glad I got the six because this looks quite big. Like, I want it to sit on the top. It's got the little button, and then it crosses over and ties. And then my favorite part is this little frill detail at the bottom. I just feel like it's so cute and girly and not, like, anything that I wear a lot. Like, I've more recently, like, last summer, started wearing some more pieces like this, like, little cute cords, but... Before, this wasn't really my style, but I feel like I'm going to embrace the frill and I really can't wait to try this on. So I'm a little bit, like, disappointed in this one and not in the sense of, like, the actual items, but I just don't really like the way that it looks on me. I think it's really pretty from the side with the little, like, detailing, but 
I don't necessarily think it's the most like flattering thing on my body front on. The way that it cuts me off, like I feel like maybe just a little bit more midriff would have needed to have been showing. Um, and I will bring you guys down because you can't even see. This is how it looks. So like it's still cute and definitely like Grecian holiday vibes for sure. But I just don't necessarily know if it's the best fitted item on me it is really pretty and like i really like the quality of it and it all fits well i probably could have gotten a size down in the top but it does fit fine because you can tighten it at the back here so it does go slightly tighter um i don't love it or hate it um i think that it's okay but i don't know if i want to keep it just because I don't know how confident I feel in it. I like it from the side and from the back, but not really too much from the front. But let me know what you guys think. Like, let me know in the comments if you guys think that I should keep this or if you think that I should return him. So my lovelies, that was everything that I picked up from ASOS. I hope that you guys enjoyed the video and liked seeing me try on all of the different cords. Let me know uh, what you guys want me to test out next. I have had quite a lot of requests to do like a jeans only video. So I was thinking in my next ASOS video I could test out all the jeans that they have on their site. Obviously not all of them. Um, but test out the jeans on their site. If you did enjoy this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to join our little fam. Our little family. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching another video on my channel. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.